Hi you guys and welcome back. So I'm in a rush to go to the hospital. You guys know that my cousin, my elder cousin is in the hospital in ICU. So I'm sorry that I can't get this DIY out the way that I want to. But I'm going to just explain to you guys really quick how to do this. So this picture, if I come up close, you definitely see that it's a printed out picture from Pinterest. But when I go back, you can't really tell that it's a printed out picture. It's like something I got maybe from the Dollar Tree or the 99 cent store only. But um, I have a Pinterest account and you're more than welcome to follow me on there, which is uh, my name on there is Cuppy27, C-U-P-P-I-27. You can find me on there and you can definitely steal some pins if you want to. Um, and my printouts too as well. This should be in my printouts. And go ahead and print that out. Get, go to the Dollar Tree. You don't have to buy a fancy uh, frame. Go to the Dollar Tree and get yourself a dollar picture frame and definitely print it out and I got this this fell off something I don't I'm not sure what it fell off but it fell off and I just kind of put it on the edge of this but what I did is just open up the frame and took all the good stuff out of it except the the um, glass place the picture inside of the glass make sure you kind of center it so where everybody can see it and then start um, on the picture, sometimes it has like people on there, um, you know, families with photos and stuff on top on, on the front of the paper. Make sure you turn it around so that you can definitely get that white part of the picture so it won't look like, you know, you just half did it. Um, and then place the, the picture on the put place the picture on the mirror for on the oh gosh, I can't get it out. But place your picture on the glass, center it, then place the picture um on the white side on top of that and then whatever else comes in it place that in there and then lock it all up and you got yourself a diy picture and then i'm gonna show you the other two that i did as well also i did these as well it's kind of crazy because even though i said this to my pen look you guys you can definitely see my picture on there so this is one of my pens that i um i have in my my Pinterest. Uh, once again, the C U P P I 27. That's my Pinterest. Go ahead and follow me, and I'll definitely follow you back. I love Pinterest. I love taking people, you know, DIY ideas. I love all that good stuff. So make sure you follow me. And this is going to be just like a little come in uh, where people can see. It's like homey. It's relaxing. It's comfortable. I got this little, um, it's a little flag with my initial on it. I definitely will, will be putting that in a picture frame. Or maybe put it, on, um, put it outside my door when I do my wealth. But I'm sorry you guys I couldn't get to this DIY like I wanted to. So I hope that by me explaining how to do this, you guys can go ahead and do this. But I really um, am desperate on time right now. Um, I may do a DIY probably maybe tom tomorrow. I, I don't know if I'm going to do one tomorrow. But... Either who, you'll get this vlog by tomorrow, so I'll do it on Monday um, and show you guys how to do this. Um, but anyways, you guys, I love you so much, and um, keep me and my family in your prayers and all that good stuff. Once again, let me explain again. <laughs> so you can go to the Dollar Tree or the 99 cent store only and find these picture frames for cheap, $1.99, whatever the price, it's going to be cheap. Definitely go on Pinterest and find you some pins that you can print out, especially with the holidays like, you know, autumn. Um, find it, go to the website, print it out, and definitely cut it to shape. Measure it, make sure that it's the right um, picture, the right shape. Go to your local Dollar Tree, find the picture frame that it fits in. If it doesn't fit, you can always cut it down because I cut both of these down. Cut them down. Take the, um, put it on the top of the glass. If it doesn't come with a white trim, definitely turn the picture over to the white frame. If the picture on the right, on the other side is not a white frame and it has like maybe like let's say brown parts on it, definitely whatever you cut off your picture, your original picture, save it and put it on the edges so that it can look like, you know, it's, you know, nothing's wrong with it because that's what I did with this. This one right here was really short. It was a really short picture. And so I cut like the extras that I cut off of here. I put it on top. As you can tell because it doesn't even match up close. But back here baby it looks like it matched. So definitely do that. And put everything that comes inside the picture frame back on top of 
everything that's on the picture put the back part on the picture set it up and boom there you go you have a nice picture that looks like not a million bucks but it looks like you you know spent a quite a few dollars on the picture so ain't nobody got to know you gotta tell nobody where you bought it from because girl as long as my family know they probably think i got it from tj maxx or jc or something like that but anywho i love you guys again and definitely be watching out for this diy coming soon which is monday because i didn't really have time to you know get to it today but i just wanted to show you guys how you can make your own pictures at home for free but only buy these picture frames for cheap at the dollar store or the 99 cent only store and these picture frames colors do not even match um see they don't they don't match together so um i just really love to decorate my home like in you know kind of bronzy farmhouse type and different areas of my room is going to be looking totally different from each other so um this is going to be looking cute this is on my bar y'all i don't even drink you know what i'm saying it's still fulls of wine and stuff but um i just like to keep a little some just case you know my family want to come through or some friends want to come through and just have a glass of wine um anywho your girls got to go bye